All right, everybody, we're back doing a new video. It's uh, supposed to get a little thunderstorm activity today, so we're going to get this set up pretty good. We got some tarps set up. Um, welcome back to the channel. If you've been here before, if you haven't, uh, my name is Sean. Um, <clears throat> we're just going to do uh, a little bit of camping and cooking, and uh, let's get this camp set up. Yeah, definitely going to do this tent this time. I talked about it on the last video, and I realized, you know what, I haven't used that tent, and I can't tell you how long. And uh, I said what good a condition it was in. I don't really know anymore. So this is what I was talking about on that uh, top three video that I just put up. I'll put it up here if, if you haven't seen it yet. How the seal nylon comes up at least uh, six or eight inches before the mesh starts. You want to uh, have that if you can. That will keep the water from splashing in that might come up under the rain fly. But when I do this rain fly, you'll see how close to the ground it is. So these are those tent stakes that I showed you also on the on that last video, the one I'll put up here. piece right there both sides Like I said, these things get used every trip. Green elephant poles. Every single trip. To try and keep, maybe keep the thinner portion of it 
at its shortest, depending on just because of the weather. Keep it that much stronger, hopefully. This is California and it's camping season and it's hiking season. There's all kinds of activity out and about that you may hear. Hopefully not too much of. So we'll take this, we'll make a loop. That's the top one. And then we'll make a loop on the bottom one to hopefully suck down. You see that? Yeah, I'm sure you can see that. Suck down nice and tight right there. How you do it? Uh, now, just, uh, I don't see if you noticed, but uh, this is a four-person tent. Again, I'll put the video up here where I talked about how this is not a four-person tent. I don't care what it says. Uh, this is just enough room, in all reality, for me and my crap. But you can put two people right here. You know, two adults with cots or whatever. That's it. Again, all the pillows came. build right there. I think I'm going to get one of the tarps out and stretch it over. Definitely time for some lunch. Especially with no breakfast. So, I really enjoyed that sandwich up in the Kern River. And I thought, what if we do it again? But this time, a hot version. Yeah? Never got clean. We'll be cleaning it this time.
garlic paste. This is what we're going to do different. This little charcuterie mix is actually really good. And it has kind of everything you need for an Italian sandwich. Just two pieces up to cut it. What do you think? delicious. Mmm, it's pretty good. Really? Probably could use more cheese though. I was afraid of the mess that was going to make. Let's go to the table. A crunch on the bread. Jump. Well, our thunderstorms are kind of getting here. They haven't quite kicked in yet, but they're they're there. I don't know if you can see them. I'm getting some thunder here and there, and uh, a couple hours from dinner, I got at least three or four. I'm still full from that stupid sandwich. So, anyway, I'll keep checking back in with you, especially if these things kick off. They do look like they're building, so. We will check back in if we get some rain. dinner going. I'm starting to get pretty hungry. It's like 6.30 already. So let's get our tater tots going. Squared away anyway. <clears throat> I don't know if you know this trick. I think you 
take the foil, wrinkle it up. Like that. And we will still give it a shot of cooking spray just to make sure they don't stick. Get that part ready, that's done. This is not even hot yet. Take out that season. Season it up, and then we'll let it rest for a while. Ourselves a nice fillet there. I'm thinking on this bad boy, this trip. Oh boy. Salt and pepper. Alright, so we got our oven going. Steak's getting room temperature. Let's do our uh, tots. Oops, that's a lot. Oh yeah. I went a little too long there. Done, probably overdone. Yeah, those few extra minutes were just a little too long. Or medium. Got some runners. dinner. Overcooked steak and tater tots. It'll be yummy. These are mosquitoes, damn it. I'm just landing on my face. filming through most of the afternoon so we're on a much later time frame tonight I don't even know what time it is it's got to be close to nine I'm usually crawling into bed by nine but uh, just get to stay up a little later get to use fire pit and uh, it's gonna chill for a little bit until I get tired Got everything done, uh, cleaned up, put away. Uh, got dinner cooked, bright light. But uh, oops, we're going to see if I get a better view. Nope. We're going to head to bed, just because it's 9:30 now. So let me bundle this up, and we'll see you guys in the morning. Start up is right at five o'clock. We're going to get up and uh, get our junk packed away, start making some breakfast, catch the sunrise, and uh, I'll bring you back there.
boiling. Look at it go. You guys missed out on the first one. It's all nice and everything for you. And realize that idiot cameraman of mine didn't press play. Hey Siri, set a timer for three minutes. Three minutes, counting down. Three minutes are up. Let's give her a squish. Not from there, it's from my mouth, obviously. First day with my new lips. I think I need for a couple of pancakes for me. Yeah, you know what we'll, we'll get that sausage going. I'll mix that up after. <clears throat> and then I'll, I'll take this home and uh, rinse it out and pour the dry ingredients back in it. And then I've got it for one more trip, maybe two. Some basic old Farmer John. Sausages, yum. Got butter on. 
on this one. Get our last one in there, and a three is my max. God dang it. Struggle is real. Last bit of butter. Welded shut. I got more house on it. Delicious. I do love pancakes. I don't eat them all that often, but <clears throat> I know why I like them so much because I don't I ruin them. I eat them all the time. Let me smash what I can of this, make something else to drink, and uh, I'll be back. All right, guys, well, hope you enjoyed that one. Um, all I've got to do here is button up the awning and uh, pick up my rug and fold up my chair. But I think we will call that the end here. Um, thanks for tuning in once again. Really appreciate it. Um, and we will catch you on the next one.